Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. We're going to unbox a Rubik's Cube. I know I haven't done any Rubik's Cube videos on my channel, but uh, this is my first one. So this is the Worm, well you can call it WRM, Worm 2021 edition. This is the, you can get a, a light version, but the packaging is just, it's like just pretty much smaller packaging, but I got this one. So let's test it out. Let's open this baby up. Take a look at it. Premium, this is premium packaging right here. And then, right here we go, look at this. Worm 2021 edition. I, I can't even, I don't even know if you hear, can hear me or anything, but let's open this up. You can't even see. Wow. There it is right here. You got, literally half of it is literally just packaging. Let's see what, what stickers, no stickers, but like random things, you can't even see. Yeah, you got this guy, this geezer right here. He's probably made it. You got, I don't know, instructions, more instructions, and a team. Wait, is this the same one? No. I got a team MoU, or whatever it's called. And in this, literally, pretty much the same size as the Rubik's Cube itself, you got some accessories. A lot of accessories. You can pretty much make up a cube just with these accessories. Actually, this has wrapping on it as well. There we go. Let's see what's inside. Okay, see so that? Um, you get pretty much everything. You literally get your own core. Like, you literally get an extra core. You get um, different things. You got a screwdriver, which is not a screwdriver in there. But yeah. And you have to. I think you have to take this box off to get underneath as well. Okay, let's go to the cube. Let's move this stuff. Giant box. I guess I can just put it there. I know it's pretty messy actually. Let me put it somewhere else. All right, let's go into the cube. This actually—it's actually a pretty cool case. If you take this off as well, there's like a bit of bottom here. If you take it, you can actually make it into a stand. But I'd probably rather keep it in the box. There it is. There it is. It's got wrapping. It's actually really light. I'm pretty sure it's lighter than the uh, RS3M 2020. I'm pretty sure. But yeah, this has got like a a darker logo. The uh, RS3M 2020. It's got like a coloured logo. Like look how small the box is. This is a small box. It pretty much just fits in. Okay, let's open this up. Let's see that. Oh. Right, I average like 30 something seconds, so don't complain about how slow I am. But actually, it feels, it feels, re actually just feel really quite weird. It's really light. What's, is it on? It's on one at the moment, because you can change the, uh, you can change the magnets. And it's on one. It's actually, it's not bad. Like, it's, it, it does, even one feels pretty weak, which is pretty weird, but it's, it's not bad. It's very sandy and dry. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna lube it up. Uh, probably with a weight five, um, MDM 38, 37. But yeah, it's, uh, I'm gonna change some time. I'm gonna mess around with it, try and get some uh, set up. So I'll be back. Also, I wanted to add that um, I haven't, I haven't tested out magnets. Like I haven't tried to change them. I don't think I need to. It's it's on one, which is the uh, you got this little tool. I don't know if you can even see it. I have this little tool. Right there. Apparently, they're really flimsy, but I got this tool. I mean, I got this on one, which is apparently the strongest, but like, let's be honest, it's not even that strong. Like, I'm trying to do like some. I think, what kind of. What algorithm was it? It was like. It's some kind of move I was like holding here, and it, was, it just wasn't as stable as I would like it, to be honest. Like, like especially for like a customizable magnet one, you'd have thought it'd be stronger for the first one, but apparently it's not. And apparently the, the like fifth and sixth setting is literally no magnets in that. Like I'd be pretty stupid if you would win that one. So I don't know I haven't tested it out like with magnets because I I, I mean I, I like stronger magnets and this this is still probably not as strong as I would like it. But yeah. All right, so I've tested it out. I've put some lube in it, and to be honest, it's actually I'm gonna move that. It's actually quite um, slower than it was before. It's, it is, it's quite nice, it is quite nice, to be honest, I actually, I don't know, I actually think the RS3M is actually better than this, to be honest, 
I don't know. Is it? I, I, I don't know. I, I do like it. It's a, it's a good cube, but I just feel like it's just, I don't know. I really don't know what, how to explain it, but it just feels... It's, it, it's definitely lighter than the RS3M. But it's just... I don't know. Maybe it's just the way I set up, but... I've put it on. Let's see what I've actually put on. I've put it on, like, I think two clicks. So it should still be pretty fast. Um, maybe it's just too tight. But I did loosen up as well a little bit, but... It's just... It's quite strange. It, is, it actually is a very strange cube. Very strange cube. I, but I do like the RS from 2020 better. Definitely. And then... Because I got the upgraded version with, like, the um, core magnets, maglev and stuff. And I, I, I just... I feel like it's way better than this. Um, yeah. I, I, actually, why is it so slow, though? I don't know. It is very slow. It's quite smooth as well, but it's alright. Would I recommend it? Definitely, definitely get an RS3M 2020 if you're gonna get this, because there's no point in spending more money on this, this cube right here, right here. No point in getting this where you can get the RS3M 2020. This is definitely not like you know if someone's like, oh, I'm gonna get this. I'm gonna block this in. Like this is just you know no. Like it's just not an upgrade. It's just not. Like if you if you want to get like a little box maybe if you want to get some like accessories maybe you want to pay the extra cash. But the cube itself maybe it I don't really know. I think from for my style I just like the R three M twenty twenty better. But probably for everyone else probably this is better. Anyway, hope you enjoyed this video. If you have, please like, comment, and subscribe. Goodbye. I actually don't know if you can hear me or not.